no better example than coastal systems and how man perturbs uh, natural systems. Uh, you know, this this wanting a beach house and uh, on on an ecosystem that is unique with their own endemic native species uh, and yet provides a strong geological hydrological role in this blend in this boundary between oceans, saltwater and freshwater. Uh, but it's unfortunately a very attractive place to live. The precedent is there uh, that the uh, you know other people will be able to build if if the uh, the variances uh, are approved and upheld and so forth. It uh, it, it leads to uh, other people possibly wanting to uh, develop on the island too, and then it, then it becomes nothing more than a uh, some of the other uh, recreational islands you see up and down the coast of the Atlantic coast. There's no doubt about the, the impact, even on the visitor experience. It's really close to Sea Camp Dock. Uh, the construction phase is just the beginning of it, and uh, clearly it would, it would uh, destroy the unique nature of the island. Well, it's a nose under the tent uh, with a thousand acres. How much of a park is that? How much is left for a park? 